Republicans, GOP, they are in fear that their wives will secretly vote for uh, VP Harris for president and not Trump. Here it is. Um, and she needs people to basically lie to their husbands, which they are promoting, by the way, which I find that entire advertising campaign so repulsive. It is so disastrous. It is just like show the it body. It is the embodiment of the downfall of the American family. I think it's so gross. I think it's so just um, nauseating where this wife is wearing the, you'll show it, wearing the American hat. She's coming in with her sweet husband who probably works his tail off to make sure that she can go you know, and have a nice life and provide to the family. And then she lies to him saying, oh, yeah, I'm going to vote for Trump. And then she votes for Kamala Harris as her little secret in the voting booth. Kamala Harris and her team believe that there will be millions of women that undermine their husbands um, and do so in a way that it's not detectable in the polling. Undermine their, their husbands because they have an independent thought. I thought you guys like free thinkers. I thought if everybody thought alike, they were on the plantation. But as soon as a woman has an independent thought, all of a sudden, that independent thought that, by the way, is constitutionally granted to them, that independent thought is undermining the husband. I, I wonder if the husband votes for Trump, but the wife wants the husband to vote for Kamala Harris, is then the husband, oh, okay, it doesn't work that way. OK, um, Kirk isn't the only Republican who feels this way. Uh, here's Jesse Waters. And if I found out Emma was going into the voting booth and pulling the lever for Harris, that's the same thing as having an affair. That to oh me. My oh, my God. <laughs> he let him finish. You're vi oh, go, that, Jesse. Yeah, it's that, our that violates our day, judge. the sanctity of our marriage. Preach on. Yes. Uh, what else is she keeping from me? Exactly. What Why else has she, she been lying lie about? Why would Roll she lie credits. to you? Jesse have you has... threatened her? Why would she lie to you? Oh, they want me to tease. He, why would she do that and then <laughs> vote Harris? Why would she say she was voting He's Trump not the problem, and then voting Harris? You. And I caught her, so and then she said, would, I lied to you for the so last four admit years. admit you intimidate It's people. over, Emma. That would be oh, D-Day. Man, you guys are really insecure. I mean, damn. Okay, uh, the Fox News team was discussing a recent ad by the Harris campaign and vote common, the ad suggests to women that with a thing called privacy, the privacy of their vote, they can secretly choose Harris without telling their Republican voting husbands. Uh, it's funny that, that Jesse Waters mentioned that this act of betrayal would be equivalent to having an affair when he admitted to cheating on his wife, Noel, with associate producer Emma, mm -hmm. who's now 27, who worked on his show, Waters World. He then married her and posted this in 2019. Wow, man. Your privilege is out of control, Jesse. Now, personally, I hope your wife is cheating on you. That's just me. But for you to say what you said on national television, sir, knowing good and damn well what you have done with your staff at the station is beyond me. Sharon, thoughts? Well, I'd like to put her in touch with Ashley Madison, is it? Is that still a thing? <laughs> and perhaps she can have a fulfilled, happier life. Um, listen, hypocrisy. But you got to remember, Doc, I know you haven't forgotten Men own women, and that's mm. the goal of uh, the Republican Party. Uh, you're pregnant, you can't divorce, uh, you can't have an abortion, I own you, is they don't even really want women to vote. I haven't still gotten all the way through Project 2025, usually when the first several paragraphs are this ignorant. I don't need to see the rest. It's a yeah. no for me. Jesse Waters exactly. is a fool, so he'll, pay, he'll get paid millions, though. He'll continue to get paid millions. God oh, bless yeah. America. Look at your life. There you go. Um, MAGA.